Four of Australia's most promising filmmakers will have their documentary debuts at F4, the first factual films festival, which is being presented by Flinders University during the inaugural Doc Week. Running from the 25th of February to the 3rd of March, as part of the Australian International Documentary Conference, Doc Week gives members of the public a backstage pass into the world of factual program making and the art of documentary cinema. Director of the conference, Joost Den Hartog, says it's a new initiative for the conference, which for 25 years has been an important gathering of professional film and television makers and broadcasters from around the world. The Doc Week program is, is very much um, designed to, um, to entertain and to educate. For everybody interested in documentary filmmaking, um, it, it is a, it's a great opportunity to, to, to get deep under the skin of, of the art form. And, and we show all the films with all the filmmakers there. So afterwards, there's plenty of time for Q and A's, and you can you can meet the filmmakers and start a dialogue. And it's it's a very um, sort of inclusive event. The F4 strand is really, um, um, in, in in my eyes, the most exciting part of the festival um, because that is um, our showcase of the hottest new documentary talent in Australia. More than 70 films were submitted for F4. The four final films are Leonie Blignot's Feel Home, the story of the local homing pigeon racing club that brings a South African community together. Heather Kirkpatrick's Mary Meets Mohammed, a modern day fairy tale about an unlikely friendship. 18 months uh, have been in uh, different uh, detention. Mm. I never saw uh, uh, harm himself in mm. Pakistan. You wouldn't have to today, would you? Because you're free, you're not and locked yeah, up like that. Just uh, I saw in detention. Mm. And Olivia Pollitt's mm. Canning Paradise, a story about human rights violation that's happening only a one and a half hour plane flight away from Cairns. And Grace McKenzie's Audrey of the Alps, the story of a couple in their early 20s who became sheep herders for a summer. The unearthing of, of new talent, that, that, that's very important. Um, that's, a, yeah, that's a big part of, of what we do. We, we, we take that very seriously, hence the F4 program. But, but also um, um, the, the partnership we, we um, have signed with Flinders University is, is very crucial to us. Um, with this, this partnership, we are able to, to work creatively with um, with the team at Flinders University and we can bring in um, a large number of students into our, our conference programs and into our um, summer school program and um, by doing that we, we, um, we provide an extension to their education and, and a, a pathway into, um, into the industry and a, and a strong connection with the industry. All our programs are, are um, designed to, to connect people and to, um, to stimulate uh, collaboration between, um, um, between filmmakers, producers, between producers from different countries, between networks. Um, and um, like with, with Flinders on board, we, we, can, um, we can pull in um, the educational sector in, in this and really streamline the, um, the dialogue between um, um, lecturers and, and industry practitioners and between students and, and potential employers um, and so on. So it's, it's a very rich, um, rich model.